Hey everybody, this is Alpha Zero at your service. I'm gonna do a review on a new episode of Denki Guy No Honya Sound, which is episode 8. Now, I really, really must apologize for this review to come up late because today um, is my sign up for my classes, and lately things got a little hectic for me because I had to go here, go there, I had to make a couple of changes and edits, and it really, really ticked me off, and it took me a long, long time. And my sign up was like at 7:20, and I woke up a little early to check out my classes, you know, see if they're good. And some of them got waitlisted, and I did not like that. And I don't like being waitlisted because the chance of you getting in there could be pretty, pretty slim, which is not a good, which is not a good, which is not a good sign. And yeah, I'm really sorry for this review to come in late, you know. So if anything else, I'll have to get started right away. Um, um. After the opening, you know, we see that Sensei is like a little tired or something, as Kanto and as Kan Kanto and the others are like um, pretty, uh, is pretty like um, concerned about Sensei, so they ask her what's up, you know, but but she she somewhat stayed up a little late or something, which is pretty um, pitiful or. And she ends up being hecka hecka tired, and she's thinking, having these dreams about like, dreams about like um these copies she has. She doesn't even know like um that they're gonna be sold out or anything. And I go like, girl, you got to calm down a bit. You just got to calm down. But so Umio couldn't get her to bed, and she says like um she's assigned as an assistant work, you know. And Umio says, hey, do what you gotta do, you know. And Sensei decides to talk to Kantoko about this, and. You know, like, um, everyone thought she's gonna quit, you know, so Honya, uh, so, um, we have, like, a Hiltan and Food Girl and Sommelier and pretty much, like, Kamiko, the girl with the camera, I believe, is trying to say her, say their, um, goodbyes or something, but as for Umio, he goes, like, hey, um, make me your sister when you make your man manga debut, okay? But, you know, like, um, just when everything was so emotional and, and pathetically sad, it's like Kanto Ko says, Hey, guys, don't get the wrong idea. She's gonna, she's not, she's gonna work part-time, not gonna quit. And then everyone's, like, taking back everything, take, taking back all their things that's supposed to be a goodbye present. And then, like, um, some of like, give me my book now. But he goes, like, she goes, like, no! And I go, like, ah, oh, wow. Pretty funny. And I think Umio Kun decides to help out Sensei after she goes like, "Hey, come on, help, help me out." You know, you think he helped me out? He goes like, "Sure." Later on, like um, he seems to be way more stressed and tired than Sensei, which is pretty hilarious. And I think we end up seeing a funny um, funny um scene with um Fugo or something. Well, I always been told my by my friend that she's like um, he she's like the best girl. I think she ends up seeing like a freaking looking like zombie whatsoever and she ends up beating it to death with the bat and then lime chart 3 that was lime chart 2 this is lime chart 3 a bunch of ghosts you know and then in the end it was actually zombies and she chases them all with the bat and I go like, oh you better run now <laughs> and so forth so sensei asked like um Umio to hang out with her on a day to the movies you know and she's thinking how stupid how she's supposed to dress up like rough and I go like oh man Ridiculous makeup. I'm like, what are you doing? And then she goes up, and then she goes like, she's decided to ask for a heel touch time for help. So Food Girl and Kamiko comes over to help her out, and things did not look so well. A little fan fanatic service here and there, which is not a good sign, but but I think it's all okay, probably. Um, so forth and so far, like um, things just gotten a little hectic around here and there and by that time like um, they decide to call Umio over without letting Sensei Chan know and so forth and pretty much Umio goes like where's your glasses or something you know and see and then like um it's like it was like where's your glasses you know and Sensei says you think I'm cute with my um glasses then and later on she goes like he goes like yeah you do look cute with your glasses on only, you know, and that pretty much ends it all, you know, um, pretty hilarious here and there, and so forth, and yeah, I think that's about it, so I'll end my review here, people, I'm sorry for this to come up late, um, my other review will come up in about like um, 30 to 40 minutes, so please be patient, had trouble and had hectic times with my classes, so please forgive me on that, so if anything else, I'll end my review right here, I'm out for zero, people, 
Have a good day, and I'll see you all in my next video, right? Later. Peace out. Bye-bye.